Once again, Ten again, little rhyme right there for you, my friend. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. Um, but I'm going to show you guys a couple of defense replays. So I've got a lot of loot right now. I'm in Crystal 3. Obviously, I'm not high up in the trophy range because I actually want to protect my loot. Because I actually have things to upgrade um, because I'm not a max down on 10. So I am down in Crystal um, and I don't mind the loot bonus down here. Obviously, it's not the uh, <clears throat> the 100,000 or more that you get higher up. Uh, but it is pretty good, and I definitely like it. So I'm trying my best to protect my loot. As you can see, I have almost 4 million gold, almost 4 million elixir. And I haven't even been raiding that much, so it's been uh, protected pretty well. The reason I haven't been raiding that much is because I've been playing way too much Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Uh, I've been posting videos of that on my second channel if y'all want to watch that. It's in the description, Molt Plays, go check those out. But um, let's go ahead and watch a couple of replays. So look at this. This guy had the opportunity to get almost a million in resources from my base. Now obviously uh, he isn't that well upgraded. Um, and he's going to use some form of Garch. Uh, giants, Barbarians, and archers but we'll go ahead and fast forward through him messing around over there with my town hall because it's taken him way too long to do it uh so he sends in some giants right there they don't get far at all <laughs> which is hilarious he sends in these giants over here he's like maybe i'll pick on this lower level cannon and then i will get wrecked by this mortar and this wizard tower so i have things set up pretty well on this base to where it defends really really good you can just see those giants just flew off from that spring trap right there. He is going hard because he sees these two gold storages and he knows that if he can get both of those, he's going to get over 200,000 in resources. But as sad as it may be, he hasn't even made it to the wizard tower yet. The wizard tower is about to go down and now he's going to head right here towards this wall and not in towards that gold. So he's got 20 barbarians left. He's got a couple of giants left. Um, I don't know what he does with them. He just got the town hall, so he's going to get his loot bonus. He drops his other giants up here. I don't know why. Um, he should have, if I were him, continued down towards the bottom where he was earlier. He has... When did he use that heal spell? I didn't even see him use a heal spell. Uh, <clears throat> maybe he only had one. I thought he had two. But he hasn't dropped his wizards, his wall breakers, or anything. He's still got his 20 barbarians. He's only got 18%, and there is still... Uh, a lot of loot left. He didn't get that much at all. It was all from the uh, from the mines and the pumps. So there's one defense from the base. I know that you guys probably want to see how this base holds up against uh, like really high level attacks, but honestly, it hasn't been attacked by anything like that. Let's go look. So um, here's another here's another giant one. This guy had an opportunity to get almost just as much loot. So we are defending millions of loot here, guys. <clears throat> well, I guess not millions, but over a million loot. So he's gonna <coughs> he's gonna start off over here on the town hall as well, and then send in some random troops to try and take out uh, stuff on the side. As you can see, he just got a thousand dark elixir almost from that drill right there. So yeah, <laughs> there is a lot available, but most of it is in the drills. You can see that little top little box on the top of that one, and this one are both full of dark elixir so he's gonna finish up right there and then drop down one of his giants he does have max level giants um and looks like uh pretty close to he has old max uh archers and barbarians uh level six yeah level six so <laughs> i couldn't read it, it kind of small but so he's heading in here he's trying to get in there to that goal because he's like, all right so there's this pathway over here i'm gonna head in here try and get to this goal get to this elixir there is that dark elixir right there as well um but this wizard is saying uh-uh i'm not having it i'm going to crush you so they are head but right now they're heading right there for that dark elixir and they are going to get it so this guy does get a lot of dark elixir from me but not from the core of the base which is where i mainly protect it um he's also going to head off over here on the side and take out that dark elixir as well which pretty much just shows me that i need to get on and collect my dark elixir more because this guy just stole 2000 dark elixir from just my pumps um, but what I really wanted to protect when it comes to gold and elixir um, is protected now. Uh, it's funny because you used to not want to protect elixir, but now you definitely do if you're upgrading walls like I am. So uh, elixir is just as important now, especially from that standpoint. But you can see this guy only got 100,000 elixir. There's 385,000 left. 
and he only got 68,000 gold. Um, he did get a lot of Dark Elixir, but again, that was all from the pump. So uh, we did, we're did. we doing pretty good on the defense down here in Crystal. I am protecting my gold just like I want to. Um, we can look further back, and let's see if there have actually been any... Uh, Oh, this freaking guy right here at the top lightninged my Dark Elixir, um, and I really want to revenge him, but he has a shield. I tried to revenge him like, I seriously spent two hours online just pressing revenge, and it kept saying he was online. I was like, why the freak is this guy still online? <laughs> Maybe he was trying to revenge somebody too. But anyways, guys, we are protecting millions. We're doing a good job of defending, uh, of defending the base right now. I kind of want to, though, after seeing those raids... Um, take this out and put this dark elixir in here and put this in here and then take this out and put this dark elixir in here and put this gold right in here. I'm going to be saving my gold because I have one more mortar that I need to max up to with 6,400,000 gold. So yeah, but that's it guys. I just wanted to show y'all. The base is doing pretty well in defense and crystal. I don't know how it would hold up up in masters and champs, but I'm not up there. So I don't really care <laughs> because it's doing its job uh, as I want it to down here in crystal. So you guys can definitely try it out. Um, it's a really good base. I, I've had, this is probably one of the longest bases that I've actually had and kept for a while. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much for watching guys. I really do appreciate it. Hopefully I'll have some new base builds out for you guys soon. Again, go check out my second channel, Moat Plays. Um, and I will see you guys later. Keep calm and clash on from me, right? Peace.